Hello and welcome back to Mafia 3. My name's James, this is Just Play, and I completely fucked that corner. And we are going to uh, see Donovan for more on Tommy Marcano. Now we know he's got. A forging operation going or something like that, so um got some intel on Go on then. Tommy Marcano brought in a counterfeiter from Cuba, right? Himself spent a couple of months trying to print the money himself, but none of it was worth a damn. The color was wrong, printing was cockeyed, you name it. He needed someone who knew what the fuck they were doing. So he used his connections and found a man named Alvarez. And this Alvarez was also counterfeiting money for Castro. Most of our enemies counterfeit American money. Hell, some of our allies do too. Sorry, he's gone. <laughs> what do you mean, he's gone? All you had to do is drive down to the goddamn lighthouse and pick him up. It's not my fault Alvarez is running all over the goddamn place. I wanted to lock his ass up, but you wouldn't hear of it. The last thing we need is Zaraga finding out that we treated his nephew like dog shit. You understand? He sold him out. Then Lincoln Clay comes in shooting the shit out of it. Lincoln Clay. Lincoln Clay. I'm so sick and fucking tired of hearing about this cocksucker. He's just one man. A fucking nigga. We're skating a thin line here, Tommy. You understand? This thing falls apart. We fucked all of us. So, what the fuck would you do? What the fuck would I do? Listen here. This ain't rocket science. If that fucking nigga got the Alvarez, it means he knows about the plate. He's gonna come after him. You understand? Get your ass down to that motherfucking gym and protect them. Yeah, sure. I'm on it. This shit ends right here, right now. No more fuck ups. Fuck me. Oh, I remember what Alvarez was doing. Tommy Marcano had the money press in a boxing gym he operated. Tommy knew Lincoln was coming for the plates, but he felt he had to keep up appearances. The second he started canceling fights and shutting the place down was the second people started thinking he was out of his league. He wasn't about to allow that to happen. How did Lincoln Clay gain access to the gym? He had me track down a man named Alcy Bennett. Alcy is a small-time hustler that worked for Sammy until he double-crossed him and was kicked out of the hollow. After that, he scratched out a living recruiting fighters for Tommy's jungle fights. If he vouched for Lincoln at the door, Lincoln could get in without a big ruckus. I'm surely everyone's looking for me. I'll stop by and say hello. See how he's getting along. <laughs> Have fun. That looks like just walking in. Yeah, that's. Let's get a nicer car. This doesn't seem like a great idea just to walk in being vouched as a boxer. But, we'll see. Yeah, I remember the money laundering thing with Alvarez being a, the money launderer and that stuff thing. Yeah. Yeah, that was the whole story. <laughs> there seems to have been more story to this district than some of the others. Let's see if I can name the story. What was that? That was the, the politician, the judge. That was the um, the racists. That's the racists, and something else happened. Oh, I did the thing at the mansion where you were a bell a uh, uh, waiter. Yeah. Okay. No, these last few mi see they've had good missions tied to them, but they've had a lot of guff to get there. The story missions have been all right so far. It's just the bullshit around it. Ooh. Yeah, so uh, hopefully once we get all the bullshit, because this is the last of the bullshit really. Unless suddenly they decide that someone's going to betray me and they're going to they're going to have to take over more brackets and oh don't do that. Just don't do that. Hello. Whoa. 
Well, fuck me running. If it ain't Lincoln Clay. Surprised to see me, Alcee? Hmm. I heard about Sammy Nellis. Tough break. I guess you made it out okay. Speak of them once more, and I'll slice you from here to asshole. Let's go. I'm taking a drive. Assuming I don't have a choice here. What do you think? Lead the way. That seemed a bit better. Some of the... <laughs> some of those sort of cutscenes are the ones where they're just literally standing looking at each other, but they took poses, and... That was a bit better than most. This wasn't my car, was it? <laughs> I stayed away. I ain't stepped foot in a hollow since November of 62. Almost six years. I know. Can you at least tell me where we're going? The Acadia. It's where Tommy Marcano holds his jungle fights, right? It is. And you've been recruiting black fighters for him. I have. Good. Because I want in. What? Why? I wanted you to know I'd have told you. If I'm sticking my ass out like that, I need to know why. Motherfucker, you lucky. Now I've got to drive all the way back. After what you did to Sammy. You really think you wouldn't notice you stealing all that money? Look, I paid for that a hundred times over. Six years banished from the only place I ever call home. Christ. I couldn't even go see my mama on her deathbed. You made your choice. And now it's time to make another one. And I do this. You get a clean slate. Come and go through the hollow as you please. Fuck. Okay. I hear if you win out, Tommy meets you in person. That true? He likes the size of the winners. See if there's someone he wants to bring on regular. Or if they're just a one-time deal. Where's this happen? Usually up there in his office. One of his guys will meet you in the locker room after the fight. He'll take you to time it. Alright. So, basically, I've got to win a fight, get taken to Tommy, and then kill him. That sounds of things. Seems like a simple deal. Why the hell is there a time remaining? In the bottom right there, time remaining. You've got no challenge to this. You can't have a time remaining. Fighters don't take the front entrance. We go in through the side door. Alright, we're going through the side door. Here we go. We'll park here. Alright, park here. I'll take it. Weapons aren't going to be a thing. Hello. <laughs> Hold up, Alcee. Who the fuck's this? This. This is Jack Knight Johnson. Is he outside? He's outside. We here to fight, boy. Gotta search. No weapons allowed. Submit to a pat down. Okay. Well, yeah. <laughs> the, the other guy's been trapped outside. Watch where you put your hands, motherfucker. Save it for the ring, dipshit. And I do have weapons, so... Okay, you didn't Go find... Ahead. Oh, they just took them all. Okay. Can I... Oh, is this fucked up? Oh, no. Is this fucked up because he's outside? Because he's trapped outside. I think this is messed up. This is completely fucked, isn't it? Oh, shit. Oh, dear. Right. Oh, crap. <laughs> right. Okay. Um, can I game? What can I do? Load checkpoint. What's that going to do? <laughs> Come on, all you need to do is spawn him back inside. It's because I ran ahead. Hopefully this should fix it. Yes, it's fixed it. Here he is. Hello. Locker room's down here on the end. Yeah. He <laughs> managed to get inside this time. Well done. I thought if you vouch for me, that'd be all right. Motherfucker needs a doctor. Just dump me in the oh. alley. Let nature take its course. You good now? Go on. We 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 like we doing like traffic, are we? Hi, you know where you at, out, see? All right. I gotta go make the arrangements. Give him your name and such. You go on and get changed. Don't give him my yeah, real name, you dipshit. New guy. New guy looks tough. My money's staying on the brawler. I gotta ask you something, Elsie. What's that? 
Do all you niggas love beating the fuck out of each other? <laughs> nah, we'll beat the fuck out of anyone. <laughs> e? So what happens if we get caught? Probably what you think. <sighs> For a chance to go home again, it's worth it. No matter what happens, we should go. Come on. I mean, it's really boxing gear. You, you're wearing jeans, for Christ's sake. This is it. You nervous? Should I be? Guess that depends on where all this ends. You're gonna head through these doors and they announce your name. Then make your way to your corner. Where are you going? Oh, I'll meet you there. This part of the show is all about you. They love showing off their fighting niggas. Go on, they're waiting on you. As right. the jungle fights continue, boys, the next challenger to face Nick Boom Boom Beaumont comes in at over six feet tall, weighing approximately 220 pounds. This is Jackknife Johnson! <laughs> Alright, didn't use my real name then. Uh, press E to work the crowd. You love this, don't you? What was Q? I don't know what Q was. Um, should we get in there? How do we get there? Oh wow, it's a proper cage fight. Oh! Oh, I'm really bad at that left alt shit. I can't hit him. Oh no, it's Q, isn't it, to do? Yeah, I'm pressing the wrong button, I'm just pressing click. Right, okay, we're done. Can we go to that office now and uh Oh, we've got two more. Oh fucking hell. My god he looks ugly as fuck. What is wrong with his face? Boom boom was a paper bag compared to the brawler. You gotta keep moving and don't let him get you in the corner. Stay out of the corner. Got it. Yeah, that doesn't really mean much in a computer game, to be honest. Oh. Come on. There we go. Done it. <laughs> Johnson is on a roll tonight. Next up, the champ. Well, go on then. Come on then. <laughs> Making his way to the ring is the beast of the bayou. The rampage of River Row. Your champion, Glenn Digger Wow, he's got a fucked up face and all. He's cross-eyed as well, but it looks to him. Does he bury his motherfuckers? Well, yeah. So how do I beat him? You hit him really, really hard. Oh, this guy's the easiest one. Bang, bang, bang. <laughs> Can you stop saying about the tomato cans? Oh, okay, let's get on with it. Oh, winnings! I got business to attend to. Let's go get me winnings. My respect, that's for fucking sure. You must think I'm some kind of goddamn moron coming in here like you did. 
never been one to shy away from a calculated risk. Maybe you should have. Make some vegetable oil in. Makes the gasoline thick, sticky. We just gonna let it soak in a little bit. Work his way into every nook and cranny. That way, when I light it, that shit's gonna burn like napalm. Oh well, we're fucked. And you. You are gonna hurt like no one's hurt before. Fuck you. Guess you ready to die. You still be conscious as the flames creep up your legs. But as they burn, you be hit in the gut with a sickening revelation. Come. Before you die, you gonna feel your pecker burn. Wow, my dick burn is. Come on, die. There we go. I'm still covered in gasoline, so... Oh, fuck. I'm pretty sure I killed that fucker. Oh no, that's the same... Oh, that's Tommy. Only thing needs working out of your funeral arrangements. Come on then, let's uh... Oh no, E. E. That's that then. Sure looks that way. You know, Sal wanted me to go to law school. Work for some big company. Maybe run for office. Do something decent with your goddamn life, you understand? You should have listened to him. It's in the blood, you know. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I mean, he's still covered in the stuff, so you might want to get away from this, Lincoln. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Might want to stand a bit back. Yeah, because you are covered in the shit. You are covered in gasoline, Lincoln. Stay away from the fire. Don't worry, I just shot you in the face. <laughs> oh, I've got my science pistol back. Fuck it. Come on. Oh, I can't see a shit back there. Need to get out of here. Um. Can I get here? There we go. I can't see shit. I can't see shit back there. Come on, get down, get down. Oh, he's guy up there. Oh. Oh, there's more. Fuck's sake. Shit, 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 shit. Go this way. Whoa, how am I missing? There's a medicine cabinet there, I need that. He's coming up there. Oh, 
Shit. Definitely need a medicine cabinet. And I'm all out of ammo for that gun. Shit, 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 shit. Get back. Two dudes and a medicine cabinet down there. If I can get to it. Hopefully they're shooting the wrong fucking way. There we go. Oh, oh, I am still on fire here. Like, we're still covered in shit. Oh my god. Okay, there's like three dudes over there. Oh, that's alright, they're all dead. Oh, I died! No, oh, I didn't even realise. <laughs> oh, oh, that's a bit Jesus-y, isn't it? <laughs> oh, dear. Hopefully it's not too far back. No. Oh shit. And why is your dog violating my corpse? No, I'm dead again. Oh, I've got some ammo for me other gun. Oh, that's not Jesus E at all, that one. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, I died this much in, a, in this game. Right, let's go for the old rifle again. No, you're not. Right. You're supposed to die, mate. No, the Can we... you gonna... Oh, come on. Oh. I think I got him. Oh, oh, health, health, health. Yes, please. And... You did. Oh, Christ. Four, three people just spawn. Oh, wow, that's a... I didn't realise that was a trophy case. I thought it was a bar of some sort. Did not see that. Oh, where the fuck that guy is? Well, that guy. Well, that guy, for starters. They're all outside. Shit. Oh, but they've left a convertible for me. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh dear. They always go after your tyres. Fuck. Let's get the fuck out of here. And I've turned the wrong way. Always go after your tyres, the bastards. Right. Oh shit! Shit! I can't 
can't can barely go. Fuck, I'm going to die. Fuck, 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 fuck. Get out of here. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Come on, run, run, you stupid little man. I think I've just gone around the corner. This is where I came in. All right, let's go back this way. Oh, and they've already got one of my tires. Oh, for fuck's sake. There's police that way. I can see the roadblock thing. Oh, I absolutely hate the police in this because they just aim for your tires. It is annoying as fuck. There's a roadblock there. Going round again. Oh, come on. Stop crashing into things. Yeah, well, I haven't got fake police incoming, have I? Sort of losing them. Just got fucking out of the way, you pieces! Shit! Now, where the fuck am I? Oh god. I don't even know where I am anymore. This is a good way to go, this is not really a good way to go, this is just going to take me back to where I was, this isn't going to help me at all, unless I can stay away from the police, then I can get out of their little circle of hatred. Oh, there's a cop car coming right for me, isn't there? Oh, fuck's sake. What is this? What is this circle? Am I supposed to get out of both their circles? What the fuck are you doing, darling? Let's run down here. Are we... Oh, nearly there. Oh, fuck it while I'm here. <laughs> Grab it. Right. This should get me out of there. The little circles. There we go. What happened to the money plates that Sal Marcano stole from the Federal Reserve? I don't recall. Wagon once told me he couldn't tell any other cheat. That the world doesn't work that way. <laughs> I spent the better part of 40 years trying to prove him wrong. When I was just lying to myself. Look at how we treat each other. Compassion is a sign of weakness. But greed is a virtue. The poor is considered morally corrupt while every excess of the powerful is celebrated. We sent kids off to die. For what? So someone can make a few bucks? Lincoln was right. He was always right. <laughs> there ain't never gonna be another Dr. King or Bobby Kennedy. But there's always going to be another Sal Marcano, another Sammy Robinson, another Lincoln Clay. We are cruel and wicked people. <laughs> Um, so that's it, we've, I, I suppose we've got to do this little bit in our clubhouse again, haven't we? Is 
Is it over? There's no one left to stand in our way. We run this city now. The district's locked down just as you asked. Me and my boys are just waiting for your word to make ourselves comfortable. Maybe I missed a call or something, but I didn't even know you were working that part of the city. Here's the thing, Lincoln. Getting you boys in here vying for turf is guaranteed to end up a pissing contest. Just easy on everybody if you give me the territory like you did last time. Let's finish this together. It's what <laughs> this turf's going to the Irish. I got big plans for this one, lad. And it starts with a statue of Marcano getting arse fucked by a goddamn badger. <laughs> Holy Christ, how the fuck did we make it through this shite in one piece? I thought for a certain Scaletta would have his throat slit by now. You did a bang up job here, lad. A goddamn dream come true. Can't wait to see where we go from here. I, I have Wade Fagan and Lincoln will have killed us all by now. What we done here? Taking the city away from Marcana and doing it without killing each other? We gotta be proud of that. I'll admit it. I had my doubts, but no more. You came through just as you promised. And I'm lucky to be a part of it. Kinda thought I'd be gay to shit by now. So anything shy of that, and I'm good. Fuck. Fuck. You know how long I've been waiting for someone to stand up and be a man of his word? And in all my fucking days, you, Lincoln Clay, are the first motherfucker to do it. Thank you. You've done a hell of a job, Lincoln. Couldn't have done a better job myself. Probably. We're living proof <laughs> that the ways of Marcano, the lying, the backstabbing, the cheating, don't need to run in that direction. Those ways are as dead as he is. Well, maybe that was the... Uh, the loyalty thing there. I mean, they all said good things. They're all happy. Maybe that was it. Maybe if I just gave too many districts to one person, the rest of them would start getting uppity about it. Um, what have we got here? Kill Sal Marcano. Are you kidding me? Is, is there actually only going to be one mission left? Right, okay. Well, we'll have to see next time. But for now, thanks for watching, and ta -ra.